everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today will be another story time video, and this actually happened like this morning. So I was taking Baxter and Shadow out to use the restroom and run around outside. And we've been out there for maybe a couple minutes, and a car pulled up and it had like a, a mom and like two kids in it. And Baxter was like minding his own business, like exploring trying to find frogs and lizards and you know he was doing him. Shadow on the other hand, as soon as he saw those kids, he ran after them. Now he's like three pounds, like not very big, you know, put him in one hand. But if a dog is running after you or bolts towards you, you know, you might get a little like tensed up or whatever. But these two kids, they're probably like Probably like around 10, maybe a little bit older. I don't think they were younger than 10. Maybe like 12, 13. I don't know. Maybe not 13. Maybe like 11, 12. They were old enough. Well, not old enough. Old enough for what? I don't know. But anyway, they were on the older side. <clears throat> and when they saw Shadow like run after them, for some reason they decided to like panic and run, like, they are trying to run a marathon and get first place run, like, and so Shadow decided that it was time to, like, play tag or something, so he kept running after them, and I was like, oh no, Shadow, come here, you know, trying to call him, and Baxter was still doing his own thing, not work, wasn't, didn't have to worry about him, so, as Shadow is running after these kids in the parking lot, the mom is still in the car, dying laughing. Like, she is cracking up because her kids are being chased by this small dog, right? And I'm like, not exactly laughing, but I'm just like, oh my god, please stop chasing these kids, you know, I'm trying to get him to stop. But he was just like, no, I'm having fun, I'm chasing these kids, I'm playing tag, it's all good, but don't worry. And the mom's dying, like, dying laughing. And then all of a sudden, the boy, I think it was the boy. I don't, I don't remember the girl doing it, but she might have. Well, anyways, the boy started crying. He like started like panicking so much that he started crying. And then I was like, oh god, no, stop! But he kept running, like he was running faster and faster, like every second. And the mom then was like, oh, oh, shit. so um, she got out of the car and was like. She's like, come here, come here, and told her kids, like, come here. And they went to her, and finally I got shadowed, and I'm like, picked them up, whatever. And then the mom proceeds to yell at her kids, saying, why are you running, why are you running, why are you crying? And then the kid's like, I thought he was going to bite me. And she starts, like, laughing. She's like, you really think that he's going to bite you? She's like, look at him, like, look how small he is. And I'm just over there like, uh, it's my fault, like, <laughs> you don't have to yell at your kids, you know. But, um, you know, they calm down or whatever, and she's like, basically calm them cats and not so nice names. He didn't say that, but anyway, so they went to go, you know, talk to their dad or whatever. And I went to go talk to the mom and I was like, I'm so sorry, like I swear he wasn't gonna, you know, bite. And I know that's not like an excuse or whatever. And she's like, oh, don't worry about it. I thought it was hilarious. Like I was laughing. Like my my baby, she had a, I guess she had like a baby in the car with it. She's like, well that's my hair. <laughs> she was like, um yeah, my baby was like interested in what was going on. I was like, oh, okay. And she's like, yeah, but don't worry about it. Like, I don't know why they started running. Like, look how small he is. Plus, they love dogs. And I was like, yeah, sorry, you know. And didn't really have much else to say. So then the kids came back and they got in the car and they left. Well, I talked to the father, who I've previously known. And um, he was like, so, your dog's trying to get my kids, huh? And I was like, yeah. He was like, which one? And he thought it was Baxter. And I was like, no, it was the smaller one, Shadow. And he was like, what? They were running and crying about him? I was like, yeah, but you know, like, it's my fault. He's like, no, don't worry about it. Like, every time, like, they come, they see these two, like, leaning over the balcony. And they, like, talk to him and play with him and everything. They are like, he was like, it's no big deal. I told him not to run from, like, any kind of dog because it just makes it worse. And I was like, yeah, I understood. But, you know, I'll try to... Keep him contained next time, you know, I don't want that to happen again. He's like, oh, don't worry about it, don't worry about it. So we talked a little bit more, and he wasn't mad, the mom wasn't mad, the kids were probably mad. But no one got hurt, maybe their egos a little bit, or <laughs> their feelings, but nothing like that. So he's calmed down this 
you know, after that, but he got in trouble. So anyways, that's it for this story, and if you enjoyed it, like my shit, comment, subscribe, thanks.